Multiple myeloma is a blood cancer that affects plasma cells in the bone marrow. Plasma cells are an important part of the immune system. They make antibodies that help fight infection. When plasma cells turn cancerous, they multiply and can become multiple myeloma. A healthy immune system finds and kills abnormal cells, but myeloma cells can disguise themselves to look harmless and multiply unnoticed. Eventually, they crowd out healthy cells in the bone marrow and prevent the immune system from fully doing its job. How can this be managed? There are several treatments that kill myeloma cells, including injectable and oral medicines, chemotherapy, and stem cell transplants. Some of them have the ability to help the immune system while also killing myeloma cells directly. In the last decade, treatments that work with the immune system have become an important part of treating multiple myeloma. Treatments that work with the immune system have the potential to help healthy immune cells communicate with each other. They can mark myeloma cells to be destroyed and limit the blood supply of myeloma cells. They can kill myeloma cells and promote the growth of new healthy plasma cells. While no one treatment works in all of these different ways, their mission is the same, to keep multiple myeloma controlled for as long as possible. These treatments include injections and infusions administered in a doctor's office and oral pill forms that can be taken at home. Even when treatment is effective, some myeloma cells may remain in the body. Over time, they build back up and the disease returns. So it's important to discuss all of your options and create a treatment plan with your healthcare team. To learn more about two oral therapies that work with the immune system to fight multiple myeloma, visit mmtreatmentoptions.com.